Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. I hope you're doing well. I'm going to do a check-in on the Divine Masculine in a karmic situation. Remember that can be anything. It can be a relationship, a job, family member, friend, addiction, behaviour. Something that has got in the way of your connection with your DM that involves karmic lessons for the DM, but also for you, Divine Feminine, don't forget that. Because we all have Divine Masculine energy within us as well. So you might find this relates to you and your situation. So let's start with the energy of the DM at the moment. Remember this is general, won't resonate with all of you. That would be impossible. Okay, this has been coming out a lot actually recently for readings, um, so I feel a lot of DMs at the moment are making decisions. Um, you might have found in your energy you're feeling this. If you're feeling all over the place, maybe you've been a bit poorly, maybe your energy has been, been a bit off. So they're certainly thinking a lot about this situation, really studying their situation. Again, whatever this is, whether it's work, relationship. It's interesting he's holding three crystals, so I feel DMs have got a lot on at the moment. And with the three, that can also be the Divine Feminine creeping into their mind. So you may find at random times you think of them. Because they're also thinking about you. They want to have victory in their life. So I'm feeling they're unfulfilled at this time. See, so they're closing their eyes and imagining the future that they desire. They're almost manifesting it with these crystals. And some of them want to walk away from this situation. They feel there's something better for them out there. They're being guided by their spirit guides here. A lot of spring energy coming through, so it may be after the winter that they actually do this, especially those who have a family, you know, because it's quite a difficult thing to do. We've also got two tens here. 28, 46, breaking down to 10. So a completion for a lot of divine masculines. Realising what they want. And I'm just getting a feeling a lot of them are realising they're, they're just unhappy where they're at. Anything else on the DM? Yeah, we've got storm morning, another 10. Interesting. So something is brewing for some DMs. Some of them don't know this because this walking away could also be someone else walking out of their life. But with all this thinking they're doing, I just feel they're heavily considering now um, their needs 
It's interesting I said about children. And we've got family here, but it came out, out sideways, which is showing they're struggling. Um, some have a family and it's just things aren't going well. And some, this is what they wanted, but they're realising that's kind of going out the window. Spirit is showing them this abundance they could have if they connect with spirit. We've got number three, showing mind, body, spirit, um, like the three crystals here. So you might be seeing a lot of threes, divine feminine. And here we've got a four, wow. So the three for the divine feminine, the four for the divine masculine. So, you know, like balancing their energies. Their energy is a bit off, but Divine Feminines, I feel you're doing very well. And it's like, that's what they're seeing, even if they don't see you online or speak to you. They just feel that your energy is really high vibrational right now. Okay, so with the tarot now, some of them have been getting headaches. You might have been getting this as well, as I said, some physical ailments. Okay, quite interesting, the imagery here, again, showing someone not just walking away, but running away, <laughs> getting on their bike. So this could be, yeah, leaving their family home. They've really been meditating a lot with this thinking they've been doing, finding their balance. connecting with their heart, what they truly desire. And as I said, realising that isn't, their heart isn't where it wants to be. <laughs> um, we've got this ship in the background, that's you, Divine Feminine, on their mind. Yeah, they've been through life lessons, very heavy lessons. Wow, it's interesting I said about the headaches. Look at that imagery, that's what I was feeling. Not just physical headaches, but stress. You know, they've wanted to break free. Move home, as I was just saying, pack their bags. Find their happiness and ascend. Yeah, they want to reach that energy that you're at, Divine Feminine. So what were the lessons? Because we just had there about lessons they've been through. Let's ask, what were the less karmic lessons?
Okay, so I feel for a lot of Divine Masculines, it was around realising their potential, their power. Um, both these cards are showing that. Notice his hand and the light coming out of the hand to manifest and grow something on their own. So this could have been what they've been doing growing a business, growing themselves in particular. Trusting in themselves and their, their manifestation power, which twin flames have, you know. Their lesson was also to change, make changes, do things differently. Sort of let go of things from the past that they've done and do something in a different way. So you see how this is all for their highest good, you know. So for with you, for example, maybe they treated you like you were unworthy, but that's how they felt about themselves. So this time round, they've learnt their own worth, filling up their own cup, which means they can then offer that to someone else in a healthy way. Yeah, a lot of empowerment coming through here, strength, happiness, the world is about karmic lessons as well. Yeah, making decisions, um, committing, not just to themselves, but to something, a job, a person, you know, especially if they were in this Knight of Wands energy, you know, enjoying life but not really regarding other people's feelings. Notice here, his heart opening and it's like he's ascended. So they've learnt to love themselves, yeah, and to feel unconditional love. And to restrain themselves. <laughs> you know, this passion that they have. In the past, it might have gone, let's just say, towards a lot of people. And then they sort of realised that that didn't bring them anything. It left a void. So they have, yeah, with this reflecting, they are thinking back on what they've been through as well, Divine Feminine. Let's just clarify here. Okay, well. Yeah, a lot of challenges that they've been through and delays to their journey. So as they've been reflecting, they might have been writing as well. They could have been studying something new. Finding their happiness, as I said before. That was their lesson. They weren't happy within. Some of them are now, and they're realising in the situation, they're not. Wow, it was also... Okay, they've, had, they've been having dreams recently, I'm getting here. I'm realising 
what's written in the stars. We've got the Six of Cups and memories, from, a lot of nostalgia, memories from the past. Thinking about who they want to commit to. So that's what they're doing at the moment. And they want to come out um, in terms of how they feel. Again, this is showing like heart opening, love. healing, committing, expressing themselves, yeah, all these things that maybe some of you are thinking, yeah, they didn't do that with me, for example, so now they've, they've learned some lessons. Okay, what's their potential next step? Yeah, that one really flew there. So I'm going to take that. Wow. So we've really got a transition because you probably noticed the Emperor flew out there. Um, Divine Masculine Energy. So thinking about the next move and taking that step, but it's not going to be easy for them. Um, a lot, a lot of thinking again, as we had before, in their head, very anxious. Spirit again around them, trying to show them the way. So they may feel very lonely during that time lock themselves away they could be in hermit mode right now I feel you might sense that there's not much going on and then they're going to break out of that with the emperor so like that um, just find that card the garden coming out of the shell. What might the emperor do? Wow. Move towards his queen of wands. <laughs> Who for me is, you know, his twin flame counterpart. Notice, you know, the imagery, she can manifest, he or she can manifest, and it's very abundant already. So like the energy we saw with the magician, of manifesting, this is who the DM starts thinking about, and their next move. And look at how happy the DF is. Okay, one more on this. So, for both of you, um, you may need to stand your ground with each other because it's two very strong energies here. For you in particular, Divine Feminine, um, they're showing solar plexus motivation. So if you're unsure what to do, even at the moment, you know, just keep meditating, keep your vibration high, have this, imagine this bubble around you. Here's the DM again, opening the heart, wanting to apologize. Mm. 
wanting the four of wands with you, Divine Feminine Happiness. After a stalemate, and there's a lot of passion there, finding the strength. So for some DMs, this is a really critical moment for them, this choice point. Wow, the sun again. As I was saying about the DF feeling really happy, so success and happiness. And we've got 31 breaking down to a four, the number of the emperor, do I masculine? Yeah, some DMs have been through a very difficult time, suffering, maybe some conflict with other people, or just within, as we had here. Not really wanting to look at themselves, at their shadow side. But they will want a new beginning, you know, that's on the way. They won't stay in that energy forever. We've got 13, 31, mirrored number as well. So here they are with their rose, <laughs> um, wanting to express their love. New beginning in love. Yeah, after a difficult ending, moving on again, that energy of moving, movement. They may travel to you, Divine Feminine, or, or yeah, move home. Okay, um, gonna finish with my new handmade cards you probably saw in the Twin Flame reading so a message for you to find feminine from the dm oh, wow <laughs> okay yeah that's a message there showing they're all over the place and we've got here i'm feeling very emotional right now which is the king of cups Okay, so I'm not going to take those. I have so many things I want to say to you, yeah. See all those cards that came out. Wow, I want a fresh start. There we go. There's that child. Their new beginning. Some of them are thinking about what they want, you know, as I said before, and that's to have a family. Okay, so that could be with you, Divine Feminine, if that's possible. I see things differently now. Yeah, so they've really grown from their situations. Time stands still when we're together. Beautiful. Very common for Twin Flames because you feel so comfortable in the energy together that um, 
you just forget the time sort of thing. Um, yeah. Okay, everyone, I'll leave it there. I hope you've enjoyed the messages that came through. Please do comment if it resonates. Sending peace, love and light to you all. And I'll see you soon.